and I am back. And as I said, I think we're gonna go shopping. But before that, let's see what we can see. Yeah, unfortunately, I am completely out of uh, platinum, if I'm not mistaken. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Of course. Plague on Omega dealt with plenty of time to analyze collector intelligence. Impressive laboratory setup. Missed working for operations with a budget. AI in particular, very helpful. Best setup I've seen since work with Special Tasks Group. Uh-huh. Is your assistant Daniel settling in all right? Quite well. Safe and secure. Neighborhood mostly quiet with plague gone. Left him the security mechs just in case. Can't be too careful. Also tired of mechs. Noisy. Never used them in STG. You said you were in the special tasks group. What kind of research were you doing? Not simply research. Several recon missions. Covert. High risk. Served under young captain named Kirihi. Studied Krogan genophage. Took water. Tissue samples from Krogan colonies. Uh, I know that guy. Hold the line. I worked with an STG captain named Kirihi. His team helped me destroy Saren's cloning facility on Burmire. Heard he was part of that. Jury rigged explosive. <laughs> Always got job done with limited resources. Good captain. Bit of a cloaca, though. Loved his speeches. Hold the line. Personally prefer to get job done and go home. <laughs> Probably military bravado. Jargon. Chest pounding. Uh, no offense. Why would STG study the genophage? Krogan Rebellion's bloody, dangerous, nearly as bad as Rachni attacks. All species evolve, adapt, mutate. If genophage weakens, need to be prepared. What was the STG preparing to do? Military schematics for likely Krogan population growth, political scenarios for attack points. Genophage reduced Krogan numbers. Species aggression unchecked, population explosion would be disastrous. STG helped check Krogan Rebellions, needed to be ready to do the same. Simple recon. Nothing to worry about. Interesting. What was the STG preparing ah. to do? Military... Je STG it's... helped check Krogan rebellions. Nice talking with you, Morden. I should get back to work. Need to study. So much data. Here if you need me. Whoopsie. Yes. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Of course I do. Command request. Uh, right again. Did you hear? Another colony went missing. Ferris Fields. Ferris Fields? Didn't Hadley have a brother stationed there? Yeah. It's taking pretty long. Shepard. Need me for something? Have you got a minute? Sure. Just checking the weapon systems. You can never be too careful. I thought I'd seen every weapon in the galaxy in our fight against Saren. Mercenary work showed me otherwise. And now Cerberus rebuilds the Normandy with a few upgrades to boot. I wish we joined up with them sooner. I'm pleased to see that you're getting along with the new crew. They're as friendly to me as people from a group like Cerberus can be. And they've got you vouching for them. I can't exactly doubt your judgment. Not after I got my own squad killed. You what? How did those mercenary gangs take down your team? It was my own damn fault. One of my people betrayed me. A Turian named Sidomis. He drew me away just before the mercs attacked my squad. Then he disappeared. Everyone except me is dead because of him. And because I didn't see it coming. You sure it was a betrayal? Maybe they took Sidonis out first. No. I put out feelers with some old contacts. He booked transport off Omega just before the attack. He also cleared out his private accounts before he left. He sold me out and ran. Do you know where Sidonis is now? No. His trail vanishes after he leaves Omega, but I'll keep hunting. I lost my whole team except for Sidonis. One day I'll find him and correct that. 
Thanks for coming by, Shepard. I've got some things to take care of. Touchy subject, apparently. <clears throat> anyway, I was saying something about some shopping. Yes. No messages for you, Commander. Right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Cycle appearance. <laughs> ah, tactical cloak. Yup. Let's see, assassination cloak, you are the master, ah, gaining a huge bonus to damage <coughs> if you attack while cloaked. Mm, hands cloak basically lasts two seconds longer. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with enhanced cloak. Incisor. Everything is as it should be, except this. Judging by the quarantine reports, the plague has been completely eradicated. Shepherd. <clears throat> I have also run searches for reports on Archangel. The various mercenary groups appear to believe that he is dead. Works for me. Yeah, of course it does. Sniper rifle damage. This is valuable. Thank you. Come to my store. It's not just boring junk anymore. I like this uh, this guy. He has weapon mods, armor mods, models, and porn. Wow. Well, Porn is porn, you know? So, yeah. The Shepherd Memorial on Akuz is expected to open next year once the area is declared safe for visitors. Admiral Stephen Hackett will preside. Sweet soul, yes. A source reports that the attack on the human colony and freedom's progress is being investigated as a possible terrorist attack by dissidents from former council races. Interesting. Hello there. Might I interest you in some salvage tech? Every credit goes toward a ticket to get me off this forsaken rock. No one in their right mind would pay these prices for salvaged parts. I know. That's crippling my sales. Drop your prices and I'll consider buying. Otherwise, I'll keep walking. You're right. I'll give you whatever you like for the original price. And if this gets back to Harrod, I'll deal with it then. What brought a nice kid like you to Omega? My pilgrimage. What money I had got stolen within a few days, so I decided to sell salvage parts. You can see how that turned out. Harrod's forcing me to sell high, and I can't even afford a ticket off this station. Why does Harrod control your prices? Harrod made me swear not to undercut him, no matter what. He was here first, so it's his right. 
Well, no one will buy from me when he's so much cheaper. I can't save enough money for a ticket off the station. Uh. I could go talk to Herod for you. Get him to ease up. I won't stop you. If you can convince him to lay off, then maybe I'll get off this station after all. His shop's up the ramp, near where Marsh sells his goods. Anything you can do will be much appreciated. I have to go. Please check with my kiosk to see what I have for sale. And thank you. Well, at least she didn't say I should go. Tentatively excited. Welcome, human. What can I get for you? What kinds of things do you sell here? Friendly, salvaged parts. All kinds. Mostly legitimate. With pride, my prices are the lowest anywhere on the station. You won't find salvage cheaper than mine. Tell me about your deal with the Quarian over there. Suspicious. If I had made such a deal, I would certainly not be inclined to discuss it. Accusatory. I don't understand how it is any concern of yours. Just shut the Quarian down. If you're worried about competition, why not just buy out his store? Intrigued. I had not considered that before. My fellow merchants on Omega are not known for being easy to shut down. A weak, homesick kid like that shouldn't be a problem for a man like you. Devilishly excited. I have plans to expand. On your advice, I will conquer the Quarian child. Grateful to thank you for your counsel. I offer you a discount at all of my stores. I have things to do. Courteously, have a fine day. Take a look at my kiosk if you want to buy anything. Hack module, yes please. Well, sorry kid. That was such an asshole thing to do, I know, but, but... Oh god. What have I done? Oh, he's gone. Uh, oh yeah, uh, we're supposed to get this for the engineers. Maybe skin weave, expensive. This looks interesting. Shotgun then. Heavy uh, weapon ammo, yes. Good. Good, 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 good. Stand away, human. I've not done anything to you. Alright, so I think that's our shopping done. Kent. Right, 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 right. I'm, I'm supposed to deliver something to Arya. Good, 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 good. Come on, let me in. job she needs doing. You up for some work? That depends on what Arya has in mind. Arya's gotten word that some blood-packed mercs plan to kill an old acquaintance of hers, a Krogan named Patriarch. She'd like you to keep that from happening. What's the blood pack's problem with Patriarch? If you've met Patriarch, you know. He can't keep his damn mouth shut. Some people don't appreciate his stories, especially when he dips into non-fiction. Oh, if it pays, sure. I'll look into it. Good. Patriarch's downstairs, likely surrounded by his fans. Get him into hiding until the mercs move on. Come back here when it's done, and you'll get your due. I'll be back when the job's done. Good luck. I don't need luck. I'm Commander Shepard. 
Uh, oh, hello. Commander Shepard? Is that you? I, I heard you were dead. I'm Helena Blake. We met a few years ago. I don't expect you'd remember. You removed two criminal warlords from power and persuaded me to retire. I'll never forget it. <laughs> and now you're on Omega. Once a criminal, always a criminal, eh? Oh, no, Commander. I retired. I know better than to go back on my word with you. You convinced me to turn my life around. I'm a social worker now, believe it or not. Social worker, you say? Is that what you're calling it these days? That's what it's called when a person works for the betterment of the people around her. Doing the good work in a place like this requires that one understand how things truly work, which makes me uniquely qualified. And if you skim a little off the top, no one's the wiser, right? Please, Commander, there's no angle. It doesn't take a saint to see that people here are hurting. I can play Omega's game and maybe do some good around here. That's the only angle. Uh-huh. Well, I'm glad to hear you're keeping out of trouble. Thank you. This is all to your credit, Commander. I have to go. Of course. You must have more important things to do. So of course I don't. Fears of an uncontrolled plague in the streets of Omega have been laid to rest as the disease is now under control. No. You said he had close family. They'll just want revenge. Kill the family first, then he'll get angry and come at you stupid. And then you kill him. I don't think I know you, human. I'm the Patriarch. Arius Patriarch. What do you want? Some people want you dead. I've been asked to move you to safety. Well, of course. Arya wouldn't want me hurt. It would make her look bad. Or perhaps Arya's reputation is no longer my concern. Perhaps I will stay. See who thinks me important enough to kill. You allow Arya to protect you like you're her pet? I thought you were a Krogan. Arya let me live. She gave me a position of honor as her advisor. She gave you a position of comfort as her trophy. Is that what you want? Or would you rather go down fighting? I wish she'd killed me the day she beat me. That would have been a glorious death. But perhaps it is not too late to die well. Perhaps these assassins will remember my name. Farewell, human. And thank you. What the hell was that about? Huh. Why did I get that? Seriously? This place makes me sick. People still dying, the strong still exploiting the weak. Nothing I did here even made a dent in this. I heard my old friend Patriarch died. 
went out in a blaze of glory. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? <laughs> I gave him what you couldn't. The chance to die like a Krogan. That wasn't your decision to make. His life belonged to me. Patriarch was dead for centuries. You know that. How he was? I'd almost forgotten he was a Krogan. You gave him the death he deserved. Do you need something else? Right! Some people want you dead. Apparently. This data pad was on one of the mercs going after Archangel. They were coming for you next. Let me see. Interesting. Would someone like to tell me how this information slipped the net? I'll, I'll, I'll look into it. You've done a lot for me, Shepard. Let me return the favor. We're sending your coordinates to a cache on an uncharted world. You want it? It's yours. What's the catch? No catch. I don't need it, and I don't want it to go to waste. Whatever you find is yours to deal with. Oh, I hope I'm not gonna regret this. Thanks. Maybe I'll come back later. You should find a nice young man to keep you warm in the meantime. You look like you need to loosen up a little. Hmm. Actually, I prefer nice young blue women. <laughs> Come on, let me in. Let's see. All right, so um, let's deliver the couplings. I think couplings, the engineers and the brandy to the doctor. Come on, loading screen. Thank you. No messages for you, Commander. Ooh, avalanche. Interesting. I need a shit load of platinum. Oh god. Mucho platinum. Oh, I need a, at least 50,000 more platinum. Shit. If not more. No messages for you, Commander. I just heard the collectors hit the Ferris Fields colony. Everyone's gone. Shit! We're going to make those dirty buggers pay. You're the best, Commander. We just got those FBA couplings installed. Now we only have to calibrate every week instead of every day. We're thinking about celebrating our newfound free time with some Skillion 5 poker. Want to join us? Come on, Kenneth. The commander doesn't want to play cards with grease monkeys like us. Uh, let them have their fun. You guys enjoy yourselves. We will. Thanks again, Commander. Yup. How may I help you, Commander? I have a present for you, Doc. Ceres Ice Brandy? You didn't. <laughs> Thank you. I always regretted not opening that original bottle when I still could. I won't make the same mistake again. Why don't we open this bottle right here, right now, you and me? You crack open the bottle. I'll get the glasses. 
<laughs> I thought Olenko's biotic display might have broken Jenkins' back, but Jenkins pops up and yells, That was awesome! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jenkins. Soldiers like him make the Alliance great. Cerberus lacks the same enthusiasm. With your service record, you could have gotten a tour of duty on any Alliance ship. Why'd you really leave? Maybe it's less about leaving and more about staying. As a military doctor, I mostly treat people who are in bad shape. Often they die. And if I can help them, they move on. Either way, they leave. Don't you have any friends or family? No, not lacking friendship. Just stability. Jeff, Joker will always have Rolic syndrome. He would never admit it, but he needs my help, and he always will. I wish it weren't, but sadly, it's true. Well, <laughs> to the ornery bastard who flies this ship. The best fighter jockey to ever take to the sky. Oh, <laughs> she's passed out. Nice. Okay, well, I'm nice and drunk as well. Um, yeah. So, I think... I'm gonna take a quick break, and then when I'll be back, uh, we will do some much-needed planet scanning. All right.